What happens when you give a War Thunder player a plane in Enlisted? Well, this. <laughs> yeah, I'm coming for you. <laughs> so you have chosen death. No, 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 no. Wait, wait, wait. Today, I play the Spitfire Mark 5C and the SBD and provide air support for my team. Subscribe for more and enjoy. All right, we're ready to go. <laughs> look at him. Why can't we have these pilot models in War Thunder? Please look at the resolution. All right, today we are using the Spitfire Mark 5C Trop. So, quad 20mm Hispano cannons with a up fully upgraded turn time of 13 seconds. <laughs> Can you imagine how much of a menace you'd be in War Thunder with a 13 second turn time? You guys need to see this montage of what this thing is like before I started recording. All right, send it. <laughs> okay, interesting. <laughs> We're on a Pacific map. Well, at least it's the uh, it's the Spitfire Mark V C trop. So technically, it's not incorrect. Okay, so the one thing we have to be really considerate of is obviously <laughs> there's a, there's a very real chance of seeing zeros, which is one of the few aircraft that can actually compete with us in the game. So I just want to get some altitude to start with before turning in but just in case there was an enemy aircraft it doesn't seem like there is okay what are we dealing with okay nothing yet what what was that oh aircraft saw that oh times two aircraft right so you're the zero Good hit. And gotta work out what you are. You are an A3? No, you're an A5. Okay, cool. And swing a big, a dig, a big, big rope a dope. Let's throttle right back. Okay, he's maneuvering. Let's get a little bit of extra turning ability. I've got to go up. That's how I'm going to get this, I think. That, or I have to completely try and out accelerate him. Got some hits. But that's about it. So let's get some altitude. He's going to try and fire at me from a distance. Yeah, okay. Let's get some altitude. Oh. Naturally, he the one 7.7 .7 that hits me gets my oil. Right, okay. Well, in this game, because there's no repairs, I might as well fight him. Because there's absolutely zero point in me... <laughs> get, get the joke, zero point. Um... And me trying to like have any sort of survival instinct now because I can't repair myself, so I might as well just send it. Okay, your ability to turn is going to be severely ham hampered. I have no idea. Maybe I can try and land on an aircraft carrier. I don't know. We'll see. How are you su surviving so many 20 mil shots? Yep, you're down. Okay, cool. So I have now either got two choices. I can either burn up my engine and just do as much damage as possible, or I can try and land on the aircraft carrier to repair, but I don't... Ah, hang on. Right, because I'm not a naval aircraft, I can't land on it. Right, okay. That is the one single thing I really do not like about this game. 
I'm I'm okay. Like the rest of my plane is okay. The fact that I cannot repair, I cannot. If there was at least a place that I could land and get out and repair myself, great, no problem. But you've now locked me into an aircraft that has got an oil leak. I can't. If, even if I successfully land on the aircraft carrier, as soon as I get out of this plane, it kicks me out. Why? Why? Let me repair. If I can land it, let me repair it. He's doing a little dance in the cockpit right now. Nice. Oh, aircraft. Uh, it's another A5. What? Where from? Uh, hello? Well, we could try and be in an SPD for a minute. I know we were going to say the Spitfire, but I mean, it's there. It's available. We might as well try and do some work with it. There we go. All right, let's get some altitude. There's an aircraft up. That's the first thing we need to take out. Go away! Where from? What? An A7. Or an A6 or A5, whatever. Where's he gone? I can't see him. Oh, go on with rear gunner. Hell yeah, rear gunner. Hell yeah. <laughs> Get screwed. Oh, okay. Well, all right. Well, we're back at a Spitfire immediately. <laughs> okay, I'll take it. I swear I just shot down that guy and he came back straight away. He probably did what I did, to be fair. Yeah, he came back in the same aircraft. Fair enough. He's about to get dunked on, so, you know. Is that a vowel? That looks like a vowel. Yeah, it's a vowel. Yeah, you're going down. Oh, I was going to get you. Okay, he's over there. Where about is he? Okay, took out someone. Those anti-air guns are lethal, though. Got to be really careful. Good hits. Yeah, nice. There we go. Right, let's go get some more ammunition. What's weird about this game as well is, the, like, all of the anti-air guns on the ground get lead indicators. Nuts. Absolutely nuts. They really shouldn't. It's literally a couple of hits from those 20 mils and you're done. Especially with no way to repair. Cannot see these guys at all. That glitch in water is very frustrating. I know what it is though. Oh, aircraft's up. It's, uh, it's the NVIDIA driver's latest ones. They fixed it for War Thunder, but they haven't fixed it for Enlisted yet. That looks slow. I'm going to guess. Uh, no, it's, um, it's a Jake. Okay, well, he's down. He must have bailed out. I've got absolutely nothing. Oh, I think I just shot him through the roof. <laughs> so you're there, right? Okay. I'm not sure if I can go through that or not. No, I can't. I, don't, I can't seem to be able to get through that armor. Yeah, my feedback for this really, for the aerial combat in this game, is it's really fun. Um, but allow me to land and repair. Like, if you're not going to give me an airfield to repair at, let me at least be able to land in a field, get out, repair, and get back in. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Why would you do that? What? What? Why would you do that? Why would you do that? Oh, what? Jesus. Jesus. Yeah, I know, dude. I feel the same. Times two enemy aircraft. I'm going to leave the vowel. And focus on the fighter. There we go. Come on. Wow, okay. 20 mils do nothing, apparently. 
Okay, right. <laughs> I'm not I'm not gonna question it. I'm not I'm not gonna question it. Right, you've got no rear you've got no tail. You're over there. I'm not gonna question it. I'm not gonna question the twenty mils and the seven point sevens and the <laughs> I'm not gonna go there. But uh, where? What? What killed me? What killed me? I don't mean to sound pissed off. I, like I really do enjoy flying in this game. It's just there's some really BS mechanics that are currently implemented that really shouldn't be implemented. So I get angry at. Like the best way I can explain it is, an example there is I got hit by one stray 7.7 round. And that caused an oil leak, which is fine, right? I don't mind that. But I, because I have no ability to land, my plane's performance is then compromised for the entire stint until my engine eventually dies or I get shot down. With War Thunder, at least I can go back to my airfield and repair. Like, I physically have to go away from the battle. Like, if you gave us the ability to just land in a field, get out with a repair kit and repair it while we're on the ground, then take off again... I wouldn't really mind, but it's the fact that I have no repair point. I just have to sit and wait for my engine to burn out. The horrors persist, but so do I. Oh, we're on another Pacific map. Okay, well, we're getting a lot of Pacific maps. Right, we definitely have to be way more mindful of um, Japanese aircraft this time around. Uh, okay, well, we can't use the Spitfire. So, let's use the dive bomber. That is Japanese, whatever that is. So Val. The enemy pushed us back. Okay, well I got some points there. There's also an enemy uh, anti-air up as well we've got to be careful of. See what I mean? For naval aircraft, look. Oh, I could go and land a repair for anything else that isn't a naval aircraft. You are screwed. Look at him dancing with his little legs. Yeah, this team, no. That's two teams in a row where I think it's been really rough. The fact they've already taken first and they're onto the second objective and then nearly taken that as well, that's that's not good. Right. Well, they're trying to capture the objective. I'm not sure what that is. Is that enemy or is that friendly? I'm going to say that's friendly. It's grey, not white. Could be another Spitfire. Or a Hurricane, one of the two. Yes! Okay, we helped. Oh, it's the longest falling bomb in existence. Okay, it's gone. Yeah, what are you? You're friendly. And he waddled away, waddle waddle, until the very next day. Dum bum 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 ba da dum bum. Well, okay. Oh, there's an aircraft down. Oh, never mind, the hurricane killed himself. But we can drop in on the six of this guy. Why is it so difficult? Why is it juddering around? Oh crap, that's a zero. The enemy has started capturing the control point. Okay, this is going to be interesting. Come on. I've still got my bomb load. I may have to get rid of it to try and dogfight this guy. Although... <laughs> oh, SBD for the win. Oh man, we've lost all of our airspeed though. Okay, what's that? That is a, a A5, so hopefully the uh Oh, something's behind me. 
Okay. I can't see anything yet, so I'm not going to bother. I mean, I could put something there, but I don't think that's actually where they are. Okay, I got four kills off of that. Fair play. Hang on. Is there nobody on the point? You've got to be kidding me, right? There's no one on the point. Hey, nice. Well, the rest of your match is screwed because you've got a damaged engine and you can't repair. What is this random jumping around? I'm not touching the stick at all. What is with this? No, you stay there. Nice. You can't hide from me. Well, I think they're going to win this one as well because, again, nobody's on the point. Oh, Tunisia. Okay, well, 5B, 5C drop, you know, in the correct area. Also, because it's a desert, I can't be able to bloody see stuff. Oh my god, look how many of us that have just spawned on that point. <laughs> that guy with a mortar is having a field day. All it's going to take is one really well-placed shot right on top of that, and they are screwed. Right, first question is, are there any enemy aircraft? Currently, it doesn't look like I've got any enemy aircraft to be dealing with, which is bloody lovely. Whoa, okay. 109 to be dealing with. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Okay, cool. I've got my eye on you now. Okay, it's a E-series by the looks of it. E-7. And... Unless, what are you? Oh, you're an IAR? Oh, you are. Find me. Go down. No, 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 no. Whoa, you lucky boy. Oh, enemy aircraft. Uh, another IAR. Oh, I got hit by something, not sure what. Got him. Nice. Oh, that's an anti-air gun. Oh, that was close. Did not like that. Those lead indicators for those anti-air is a big no-no. Okay, this should be a little bit more obvious for me in terms of um, where they're, they're attacking from. Right, contact. That is a 190. Yep, definitely a 190. A series, A5. Oh, anti air gun. Bad. Yep, see? Look at that. One hit. Just one. From the anti-air. It's bullshit, honestly. Well, at least I got him before I went down. D they've got to do something about the anti-air problem. It's, it's so, so bad. Look at that. One hit. Gone. If they're going to make the anti-air that powerful, get rid of the lead indicator. Solves the problem. It's the fact that you're giving them such a powerful anti-air... And you're giving them a name lead. It's... No. Oh, I... Oh, double kill? Double kill? Double kill? <laughs> yes. oh, I, I definitely got one. I know that for sure. We'll have to see if we can maybe take out this guy first. I think it's going to be a 109. Oh, no, it's not. Just and there's a Stuka. Come here! Only in battlefield moment. Come on, come on, Rigunner. Do your thing. 
Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's a nice tank. Watch me get absolutely splattered by anti-air. Oh, double trouble. <laughs> oh, <laughs> okay, well, I'm hit, so sacrifice for the greater good. Can I go into Spitfire? Oh, I'm not quite ready for battle yet. This is a perfect opportunity to show you how completely overpowered these anti air guns are. <laughs> completely they are completely cracked they are there's i don't get it right do we have an enemy uh friendly aircraft up no so anything up is enemy right there's our first target okay i'm going up and then back round. all right let's pull it right in on his six I'm going up. And background. Good stuff. Enemy taken out. Stuka. Enemy Suka destroyed. Right, I expect there to be an enemy anti-air up, but we'll see. Lol? So maybe I can go through that armor from the top then. Good. Couple of kills there. 14 to go. Come on, we can do this. I'm so gonna get taken out by AA on this run. So good hits there. I reckon, lads, we might have this one. Where are we being shot from? <laughs> They're not going to like that. No way they got it. What? Right, time to get some more ammunition then. They've only got 125, but still. Oh, enemy aircraft up. Is he going to just bonsai himself? Or is he actually going to... Nice, okay. Got a fight on our hands. He's down. Yep, there we go. Aircraft destroyed. Where are they at? That's one. They've been at 14 tickets for a very long time. No, I cannot believe this. They've been stuck on 14 tickets for a good minute. This is our last point of defense. Uh, yeah, some, the this is being manipulated. All right, contact. It's a Stuka as well. Gun is doing some work, but not enough. Second enemy aircraft coming in. See if we can pull in on him. Uh, are you going down or not? That was a lot of gunfire for a little biplane. As if they're going to win this. They're totally going to win this. Okay, he's down. Good. Hopefully, this is a win. Yay! Finally, we won a match. <laughs> you know what? 14 aerial and ground kills. I'll take that. That's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like below and subscribe to the channel for more content like this. Until next time, take care.